Good morning. In today's Happy Monday video, I would like to address two words that my students find very confusing. As usual, I will explain to you the difference between these two words, give you some examples and a tip or two on how to remember them better. The words are desert and dessert. These two words not only have different spellings and different meanings, but sometimes you pronounce this word as dessert, which is really confusing. But let me explain it to you step by step. Let's look at the word with two S's. This word is pronounced dessert and it is a sweet part of a meal. It can be an ice cream, a piece of cake, pudding, and so on. I need dessert. Go. The way to remember the spelling with two S's is to think of dessert as something sweet. Now, listen to the pronunciation. The stress is on the second syllable, dessert. The way to remember where the stress falls is to think that first you eat your meal and then you have your dessert. Likewise, the stress is at the end of the word dessert. Now, the word with one S can have multiple meanings and multiple pronunciations. One of the meanings of this word as a noun can be desert, the stress goes on the first syllable, a place with sands or rocks and not much vegetation like the Sahara Desert. In the desert. The way to remember could be think of a camel. Camels live in the desert. The stress is on the first syllable in the word camel. Camel desert. I hope things are clear until now, because now things can get really confusing. This word with one S can also be a verb, and you pronounce it to desert, just like the word with two S's. The meaning of the verb to desert means to abandon something or someone. He deserted us, baby. From this word, we derive the word deserted, which is a synonym to abandoned. This place looks deserted. Now, let me share with you one sentence with all of the cases that we talked about today. My friend deserted me in the desert because she couldn't find her favorite dessert. That's all I had for you today. Hope it was useful. Have a wonderful day and a great week. Bye-bye.